Greg. And I'm Katie. Welcome to the Meeple Society. Today we are going to do a playthrough of Wild Serengeti. This is a new game I backed on Kickstarter a little while ago and it just came in a few weeks ago. So let's get started. Before we get going, I'm going to just give you a kind of a brief overview of how the game plays. I've already done most of the setup to set up the game. You're going to set out your game board, of course. This is your animal board. The, what do they call this? The rock of something. I don't remember what the okay. exact word is, but it's the rock. This basically gives you your turn order, or not your turn order, I'm sorry, your round tracker, tells you what happens on each round, and gives your special awards. And I'll go into what those are in just a second. So we've put out all of the meeples. This is one of the things that attracted me to this game. These meeples are absolutely phenomenal. They're all screen printed wooden minis. Um, absolutely beautiful and it totally makes the game. So you set out all your animals. The board tells you exactly what animals need to go into each position. We've got a giant stack, if you can see these off camera here, a giant stack of what are called scene cards. You're gonna put out six scene cards. This becomes the supply, uh, the, well, you can choose from these throughout the game. You're gonna put out all your resources, your money, and then every player, oh, you already put mine up there. Every player has two of their player pieces and then that's to count once you hit 100 on the score track. So let's start at the beginning. Scene cards are basically the crust of the game. Each of us are gonna start with a, we start with eight, eight. choose four, right? So I'm gonna do four, there we go. Easy way of doing it. What a scene card is, let me see if I have some of everything. I'll just use these, good call. There are all three of them here, perfect. Okay, so there are three different types of scene cards. Um, the scene card dic dictates how animals need to be set up on the board for you to score them. So for instance, there is the ones that want animals to be in a straight line. So for instance, I have these two. This one wants to have an elephant, a zebra, another elephant, and a giraffe all in the same line. However, if you look closely here, this shows that it wants the zebra to be in grassland. So zebra needs to be on one of these spaces. Let me take those out of the way as does the giraffe. So this obviously won't work, they're all in water. So we could do it, there you go, could do it that way. It doesn't matter where the elephants are, it doesn't state that they want that. They just want these two to be in grassland. So I could do that. It could also look, well it can't look like that. It could look like this though, and that would still be a legal placement because I have my elephant, my zebra, an elephant and a giraffe and these two are in the proper terrain types. Once you've completed a scene card, you're gonna take it and put it into your area. The icons on the card are gonna make a difference throughout the game, and we'll explain the icons as we go. Another example is this one. It wants a cheetah on grassland, and it also wants an alligator. So it doesn't matter where the alligator is, but that cheetah has to be on grassland. So they can be done vertically, they can be done horizontally, so I could do it this way. It can be backwards, it doesn't matter as long as they're in a line. So that's those two. The next type of card is this type. This type wants specific animals on specific terrain types. So for instance, this one wants an elephant on a rock. So we're gonna put the elephant here. It wants a hyena on a rock as well. So okay, I'll put him there. It wants a uh, vulture on grassland. So say the vulture's there and it wants a, uh, an alligator on grassland. So we'll put him there. Doesn't matter where they are on the board, as long as those four animals are in the specific terrain types, then you can score that card. Same goes here. Wants two cheetahs on water, an elephant on water, and a hyena on a rock. Well, the hyena is already on a rock, so I don't have to worry about that. I just have to get my two cheetahs out. So I would spend time, well, one cheetah, because all I have to do is move him. I just have to spend time getting my cheetahs out, and then this guy can be scored. The last type of terrain card is the adjacency card. 
These read a little bit differently. So there's a primary animal always shown on the top, like so. So for example, this one wants an antelope in the trees. So I would have to have an antelope in the trees somewhere. It also, around the antelope, it wants a giraffe, a zebra, and a, an elephant. The giraffe has to be in the grassland. So we've got the giraffe there. Doesn't matter where they are in relation, they just have to be somewhere in the eight squares surrounding the primary animal on the card. So in this case, that would be this card. Now they don't have to be exactly that order. It could be backwards, it could be, you know, whatever. They just have to be surrounding the, the antelope. Those are the three types of scene cards. Now every scene card has two different, well, three different pieces to it. It has the requirement of what you have to do to fulfill it. It has your immediate bonus, which is down here in the white area. Um, in this case, it'd be 10 victory points. This one wants, says I can draw an extra card from the scene deck if I place this one out. So I get to draw a card and put it into my, my uh, the area of cards I'm working on. The second part is your long-term stuff. This is various icons up here in the corner. Throughout the game, there are a lot of things that require specific icons. There are score, there are cards that score based on the icons you have in front of you. Um, this is one of those long-term scoring icons. It doesn't do anything intermediate during the game um, unless you get a card that says otherwise. Then there are ones like this that do do things during the game. This gives you one of these tokens during the game at every round. So during the upkeep phase, you would grab one of these tokens. And what are those tokens called? Those are called the special effects tokens. Is that right, FX? Yep. Yeah, those are the FX tokens. Same goes, the hearts are, are end of game scoring. There's a lot of other cards in here. Let me just kind of grab a few to show you. The hearts are really important the hearts are to get. There's food, the, the little food symbols. Or again, this is an intermediate, you grab the icon, you grab the token during upgrade. The little paw prints, I might hold that one aside. That'll come into play here in a minute. More hearts, there's the flowers and more paw prints. There's these diamonds, there's only six of these in the game. So these score based on how many of them you have in front of you. So the first one, you're only gonna get a few points for. It looks like maybe 11, 13 points for your first one because you get the number of diamonds times two. So if I had three of these cards in front of me, I'd get six points plus another 11. So they, they build on each other as the game goes on. Uh, more bananas, flowers, I think that's all of them. Am I mm -hmm. missing any? Some don't I think have that's any it. Some don't have any icons on them. They're just straight out points. There is also award bonuses. The awards, this happens at the beginning of the fourth and the sixth round. This game is played over six rounds total and then the game is over. The top of the fourth and the sixth round, you're gonna get rewards based on all the cards you've fulfilled already. There are a number of them that come in the game, so it adds a little bit of variability there. The two that we grabbed off the stack for this game is the Lion Lover. So how this works is the person who has the most lions on whatever cards are sitting in front of them, there's no lions out there. So, but whoever has the most lions in front of them would get the top bonus, which is two. There's a lion. There we go. So if I had that one in front of me and Greg didn't have any, then I would get two points. You get two points per lion in front of you. Uh, the second person with the most gets one point per lion in front of them. And then if you've got more than two players, nobody else would get anything. That being said, those paw prints I set aside count as whatever animal is being scored at this round. So if I had that card in front of me and I had one line and I also had this, now I have three technically. So I would get six points for it. The second one we have out is the hyena. So on the, sec the round six, we would score how many hyenas we have in our, in our photographs, our pictures. So I'll put those up there as reminders. Okay, so everybody, when it's your turn, you're gonna take your camera and you're gonna choose where you're gonna go. Every spot has a, a dollar value on it. So say I'm gonna be working on, I don't know, give me the top card and we'll put it in the bottom. So say I'm working on this guy and I need two, two lions and a 
antelope in the water. Well, I can go over here for one coin and pick up a lion and then place him anywhere on the board I want to do. So I, play, I pay my one coin to the supply, put my lion anywhere I want it. This lion has to be in grasslands. So um, we're going to just put him up here. These top spaces basically all do the exact same thing. You go to the top one, you pay one coin, you put one animal from that section onto the board anywhere you want to put it. If you want to take the action and somebody else is already here, then you would have to go and pay two coins for that action. Or if I want to put my second lion out, I'm already on the one coin, whether there's somebody else here or not, I have to go down to the two coin. I can't just pay one coin again to put that second line out. I would have to go someplace else first and then come back to the one coin. But in the three and four player games, more spaces open up. Right, right. In the three, actually it's just four player. This one's a three. Oh, okay. So there are lock tokens on here that cover up spots for the higher player counts if you're only playing at two or three player. So that's how the top spaces work. The bottom spaces, I can swap two animals if I go here. Now these two are not available in the first round. Figuring in the first round, you're gonna be focused on getting animals out. You don't need to be swapping them around. Get them on the board first. But these two spots are not available. This one here, you swap two animals around. So I could go there, pay my coin, and literally just swap two animals out. Oh, I don't know why I'd wanna swap that one. I'd probably wanna swap this one. So, um, but that's what this one does. This one here, you can move any animal on the board up to three spaces. Animals can go through each other, but they cannot land on the same space as another. So I could not do this and share the space with the zebra. I could go one, two, three though, if I wanted to. So you can go through another animal, but you cannot land on the same location. Let's see, okay, then these spots here, you can take one card from the scene pool. You're going to start the game with four cards. We were each dealt eight. We're going to pick three or pick four before the game starts, and then the other four are going into the discard pile. This space allows you to draw one from the pool here. Over here, you can draw one. You get to, if you don't like any of these <coughs> cards, you refresh the whole stack, put six new ones out, and then draw one card from the pool. If you notice, See how these spots are small and fully enclosed? That means only one person can go to each of these locations. But these larger spots have an open bottom, means that anybody can go there. As many, all four players can go to do this same action in one turn if they wanted to. All right, so turns are gonna continue like that. You pay your coins, you do your action until somebody passes. You do not have to pass unless you are completely out of money, but you can if you wanna save money for the next round. Um, each round, you're going to get more based on the round number. On rounds four, five, and six is what is called the Great Migration. There is a stack of migration cards here, and they are all different. It tells you when you're looking at the board from north to south, which animals leave the board. So for instance, if I pulled this guy and we were playing a four-player game, all of these squares would disappear, the animals. And so basically, the, most of this half of the board would migrate off the board and go back to their holding spots. In a two-player game, it's only gonna be all the browns, the brown ones. Actually, it looks like two and three. It's only gonna be the brown spots. One to three. One to three. Like this one, it's everything from basically the top of the board migrates off. So that happens on four, five, and six. We'll shuffle those up. Let's see. Okay, last thing is Last thing I want to mention before we get started is that, well, well, two things. One, the first player marker rotates at the start of every round, um, so it will go back and forth. And the second thing is the specialist cards. These are basically an, what do they call it? Most uh, of them are in-game scoring. Well, yes, yeah, they're in-game scoring, but they are an, um, a module. Well, they're yeah. a basic, they're an extra module you can play with, you do not have to. We're going to just to show you how they work. So at the start of the game, everybody deals gets three of them. You choose which one you want to keep along with your four cards. The rest of them go out of the game. That is basically it. So I think we're going to go ahead and get started, put all these guys back. Off 
off the board. Yeah, move him back a little bit. And a buzzard. Okay. All right, so choose our specialist cards. There you go. Oh, well, nice. I haven't even looked at mine. <laughs> I think I'm going to try this one just to see how it works. Okay. Let me look at the cards here. Well, I definitely don't want that one necessarily. Don't want that one necessarily. Don't want that one necessarily. I'm narrowing my stuff down pretty quickly here. Okay. All right. I think I'm going to go with these three. Push those that way and put the discard pile over discard here. Discard pile okay. over here. And we're going to turn them sideways so we know there's a discard yep, pile. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so my... normally you would have your unprocessed cards up top, your untaken photographs up top, and all your finished scenes. cards down below, all your scenes, thank you, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then your finished ones down below. We don't have a lot of space on the table, unfortunately, so we're going to probably end up putting our unfinished ones over here and our finished ones directly in front of us, just to make it a little easier. Okay, so here are the ones I'm choosing. I did not get a lot to go off of right in the beginning, but that's all right. And then my specialist card I chose is the Celebrity. Um, the Celebrity gains bonus points throughout the game. It's not in-game scoring. It is throughout the game. So we'll see how this works. Uh, depending on the number of heart icons I have in front of me, when I complete scenes with no icons. So I, wanna ha I don't even start gaining points until I hit eight heart icons in front of me. So we'll see how this one works out because I wasn't dealt any. So we'll see. Okay. So mine's the narrator or AKA Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> and mine's an in game scoring where if I have four bananas, one flower, and one VF, VFX the, the token, special effects or token mark on it, yeah. I get 12 points because on these it's for one to two players, it's 12 points if you get a set of it. Or in three to four, it's 10 points. So for every set I get of that, I will get 12 points. Right. So the more he gets of them, the more points he gets at the end of the game. Okay. One thing I did not go over, and I thought about that as I was looking at my cards, is what some of these icons do. The, the coins, obviously, it's extra turns. It's essentially extra turns. The, v, uh, the special effects tokens, the VFX tokens, allows you to completely ignore one terrain requirement on your card so say this was my card and i didn't have the my giraffe was sitting in water instead of grass i could use this token to completely ignore that and i i could score it regardless of where the giraffe is sitting you're using the effect to make it look like it's sitting exactly in that's that one the food icons allow you to move an animal one spot so if my giraffe was here i could not even using a turn it's a free action i can move him into the grass with just by spending the food token mm -hmm. so you're luring <clears throat> him someplace else okay that being said i think we're ready to start the book mm -hmm. states that the first player if i can find it who last watched a wildlife documentary becomes um, the first player which is usually me Probably so. Yeah, I will. Let you, I think you've gone first every game we've played of this. So we'll yep, see how and this I've works. lost every game we've played of this <laughs> badly. I must say. Okay, so I am going to look at what I need here. What I want to get out early. Oh, I got rid of the card. I didn't want to get rid of. Oh well. Do I, I am looking to do. Okay, so I am going to take my one camera. Take my camera and back off. I'm going to put it up here, pay my coin, and I'm going to take this hyena and I am going to. Where do I want to place him? I want to place him in this tree right here. Why the hyena is in the tree? I'm only the best way to see him. Why the hyena is going in the tree? I do not know. Well, he's not in the tree, he's in the trees. He's just in the, okay. the tree line. Okay, I am actually going to go here and take a card from the scene pool. So, because I want these hearts for obvious reasons. Yeah, I don't have any hearts either. So, yeah. um, now with these ones here, you put out can a new card. yes, put on a new card. You can take more than one card, but for every card you take, it is an extra coin. 
If there were more hearts out there, I'd probably consider it, but there's not, so I'm not going to bother. I'm just going to take the one. Mm -hmm. Your turn. Okay, so my second action will be to go down here, pay my coin. I'm taking this lion, and I'm going to put the lion in the water. Okay. I think I'm going to mm. probably start. Where do I want to start? Let's go ahead and start with this guy. I guess I'm going to start with my elephant. So I'm going to go over here, pay my coin, take an elephant. Oops, come on. And we are going to put an elephant right there. Okay? Right there in the grass. Okay, what else do I need? You're there, so I can go and get. I should have done that a little different way. That's all right. no, My there. camera and go to. Shoot, yeah, I should have. You're right where I need to be. Well, that's all right. I just screwed myself up. I'm so gonna go right. here then. Pay one. And take a. Uh, a, a jackal. <laughs> yeah, can't remember what it was called. Uh, yeah, I'm lucky. And too. I am going to stick him in the trees up here, right? Is that where I want to put him? Yes, I want to put him in the trees up there. Okay. Uh -huh, I'm right where I need to be. Oh, oh that just stinks. All right, I'm going to go down to the zebra. I'm going to take the zebra, and we are going to put the zebra right there. And the grass also. So, I'm running Wait. out of time here. I'm going to come back down oh, here. Oh, I forgot to pay my money. Pay my buck. I'm going to take a giraffe and lay him in the tree. Man. What? Oh, you're where I want to be. I don't want to spend two coins to get there. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> well, in that case. Oh, wait a minute. No, I know what I can do. I'm going to go here. Pay a coin. Take one of these hyenas. I could have been mean and just moved your hyena out of line. But I'll be nice. And I'm going to put this hyena right here so that completes this card here so I've got my zebra in the grass mm -hmm. with a hyena in one of the eight spots around it so adjacent yep. to it and, you get and I three get points. three victory points and then he goes over here in three two star my points three star points yeah. I'm gonna stand these back then okay so they fit in the squares okay that's fine all right that's my turn okay so mine uh, where I'm at is I'm going to go down here, spend one, take the water buffalo, and put him in this tree. Yes, in this tree. And that finishes off this guy. So I got a jackal. Jack not in jackal, the trees, that's a hyena, a hyena. In a tree, a water buffalo in a tree, and a jackal in a tree. Okay. So I get a flower now, which is one of the things I need. Okay. And my th my bonus is I get a meat Ooh, and, a, and a VFX token nice. to put in a special effect. Nice. Okay. All right. So, oh, finally you moved off this spot. Good. Oh, I was about to take my score marker and move it. Ha, that's not good. I'm going to go here and we're going to grab... I think I'm gonna grab the other elephant I need. And we're gonna put him right here. Pay my coin. Okay, done. You went right where I needed to go. Well, that should not surprise you. I told you I need to go there. Well then, I'm going to end up down here to take a card. And I'm going to take this card. Okay. And throw that out. Oh, it's a heart. Oh, it's a heart. Darn it. I have no hearts yet. I need hearts. I need them more. No, you don't. Yes, I do. I need hearts to score. <clears throat> I need hearts to score too. <laughs> Your hearts work double. Yes, I know. All right, I am going to. I only got one card, le one dollar left. Let's see, what can I do that would score me something and make the most benefit of this? So how about we do this? I'm gonna go here, pay my dollar, 
um, I put out an alligator and I need this alligator to be on water to be adjacent to a jackal. So we're just gonna go right there. So he is adjacent to this jackal right here. That's, so that's, not, that's four, diagonal, that's not adjacent, it's, is it? It's considered adjacent. It's the, the alligator is the primary okay. and the jackal is within the eight squares around him. So that scores that one, which gives me a set of bananas and three more victory points. Okay. And that's how they can see now how <laughs> I lose this game every time. Okay, so. This is the end of the round. End of the round. All cards in there yep, go all away. All those cards go away, including that heart I didn't get a chance to go get. So, Mr. Secretary Bird moves to the two. We six each new cards get come out. Six new cards. Lots of hearts. Ooh, lots of hearts. And then we one. deal each other four. Uh, we deal four cards. We each get to keep one. Yep. And we get six dollars back. One, two. Give me my six. Yep, and I give you your six, and there's my six, and I get turn. first player token this turn. Okay, so I'm going to go here, pay my coin. I know, it's right where you want to be. I'm sorry, so did I. Put my giraffe down, which completes this card of elephant, uh, zebra in the grasslands, another elephant, and giraffe in the grasslands. So this doesn't give me anything right off the bat. However, it does give me three hearts to use toward my celebrity status. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Oh, look at that. There you go. Give me an extra coin. Sure. I'm going to actually move down to this one. Okay. To take this card. Okay. New card comes out. Do I want the cards or not? There are hearts, and those are hard to come by sometimes. I think I'm gonna go down here and pay one coin to take. This one gives me a food. I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna pay two cards and take these two. Play we'll two see. coins? Yep, I paid two coins. It's your turn. The two I was seriously looking at. Oh, I'm so sorry. No, you're not. I'm really not. No, she's, she's not. <laughs> not even close. Finally get back up here, since you finally decide not to go there anymore. Only every other turn. Take a Dorino and go in there, which finishes off. This card, straight line, gives me nothing except for one of those like icons that I round. need. Every round, but it's yeah. a lion, a hyena, a giraffe. And, uh, and no and terrain rhino. requirements, huh? It has no requirements. Wow, okay. All right. All right. We are going to... I'm going to go up here for one. Grab a cheetah. And the cheetah is going to go... All right. So my cheetah needs to go in rock. So he's going to go up here, which does complete this card. So it tells me I have to have a cheetah and a water buffalo in two specific territories. I've got my cheetah on rock, my water, water buffalo, buffalo in uh, in the trees. So I get an extra heart, but I also get a food token. So here we go. All right, I'm done. You're giving quite a collection of hearts over there. Yes, yes I am. I've only got four. I'm only halfway to even being able to score with them. Mm-hmm. What are those called? The hearts? They're not called hearts. They're called like, they're like icons. Like icons. Okay. Yeah. They're called like icons. And they it's do. It's a heart. It's a heart. Yeah. Okay. So I am going to go. You're right where I need to go. Okay. Always. So I am now going to just go back here. Pay the one. Pick up what Sarah thought was a. Flamingo, Flamingo actually is actually a, a vulture, and vulture. I'm going to place that vulture right here. Okay. But I'm going to use my meat and move this water buffalo up to there. I do not approve of that move. Oh, 
isn't that a shame? Because you just screwed up my card. Whatever. I, whatever. Life's just not fair. You know what? <laughs> I'm going to hurt you in a minute. Okay, and fine. As is well, on the I'm Serengeti, life's just not fair. I'm going to take. Yeah, I'm going to take him and put him right there. Okay. All right. So oh, I'm going to pay my coin. Move back to here, pay my coin to pick up this line to place here, which gives me this, which is a vulture on grasslands, a lion on nothing, and a water buffalo on the grasslands, which gives me another meat and two paws. Okay. It's all good. Hmm. Okay. How can I make this work? That's how I'm making this work. Okay, so I'm going to... No! You're in the wrong place! I don't have enough coins to do that. No, shush. I needed an alligator and you're there. All right, so I can't make that one work this round. Darn it. Can I make the way this one work? No, because you moved the silly water buffalo. Um, I can also make that one work this round. No, I can't because I'm already there. Okay, so I guess we are going to work on this one this round. And I'm going to move to here, pay my last coin, pick up my hyena, and we're going to put the hyena right there. So, oh, nope, the middle one has to be in grass, so we'll go up there. I'm paying my food to move the buffalo back to the trees. So now I have the water buffalo in the trees, a hyena in the grasslands, and a second hyena. To finish this one off, which gives me the paw print and the bananas and four victory points. Okay. <laughs> it is now second round, so I can go to these. Yes. Pay my coin, Yeesh. and I am going to move this rhino one, two, three spaces. That's right, okay. You're a butthead. Did I move something? Yes, I needed to move that jaguar right there. Oh. <laughs> the leper or whatever it is. I can't move diagonally. Nope, you cannot move diagonally. It did not work for you? And this is why she wins, because she does <laughs> stuff like that. Hey, you moved my water buffalo, and it cost me a whole meat. Okay. Oh, and you can't go. I still have no, a coin. No, I, yes, I, because I, I went twice I still have a coin, so I'm going to move to the slop animal spot. See? To do that. There you go. And I got to use this, because this one needs... A vulture in the grasslands, a jaguar in the uh, right. grasslands, a rhino in the tree, and an elephant in the tree. But I use this, and I'm going to put trees in the background for that guy. He gives okay. me nothing, but he's 10 points. And suddenly you're tied. <laughs> okay. All right. That's the end of the yeah, round. He's done. So There's nothing he's given me. So you are first me. player next round. Did I? No, what? I did not move my animal, so okay. I still have that. And then okay. we're going on to round three. So I get you an FX. FX this I turn because I have that symbol, so every round I get one of those. I did not get mine done this round. Okay, so here's your six. Oops. These will go away. Here's I didn't your get six. there and get that heart like I wanted to because I thought I'd do it the last turn of my round because I wouldn't be able to do that with the meat <laughs> and you moved it on me. Sorry about you. She's luck. always moving the goal. Yep. That's the way it works. Oh, there's a meat token. I may have to go after that one. <gasps> Give me some hearts. You don't need any more hearts. Yes, I do. You are no help, but I will take that one. Okay, so I grabbed one with a meat to a permanent meat token on it, so that is always helpful, as you can see. So we will take that one and hopefully oh, we this get is, done. This, no, I just this moved is it. just through this is round okay. three. Yep, this is round three. 
Oh, and it even has a lion on it. So if I can get it done, maybe I'll at least score something on the lions. What have I got here? Lion, elephant. Oh, well, that works. And the elephants. I'm going to take that one. Okay, so I am first, correct? Yes, you are first this round. Okay, let me see where I was at here. I need to do these, so... Okay, I might be able to get those done, but I also want to go up there. No, you don't. You don't need to look at anything up I there. I am just starting there. Of course you are. To take that, Which means you but... actually have to move. Oh, I'm sorry. But I am also using my meat to move this vulture right there. Oh, no. Well, no, that's that's correct, right? Because it's the... This being the center, yes. it's the eight squares round. So yes. vulture... Alligator. Vulture, alligator in the water. Or crocodile hyena. No, nope, your hyena has to be in the grassland. So that does not work. Because he has to be, unless you have an FX you have an FX token, you yes, could use I can it. Go ahead and use this so I can okay. get this card so out. Because yes, I get to draw another card. Right. Alright, you took the hearts I wanted. Because you are mean. Um, all right, so let's do this then. Let's actually no, I know what I was gonna do. First things first, I need to, where am I at here? He's already in the trees. He is nowhere near trees, so I need to actually, yeah, he's already in the water. He is not. Okay, so we're going to go here, take that, put this guy in the tree line. Up here, I guess, it's the only trees left. And then I'm going to also spend, I don't have a food token. I thought I had a food token. Oh, oh shoot. All right, I guess I'm oh, not no. going to do that. Okay, All right, my that's turn. my turn. Okay. All I'm, right, it's going to take me longer to I'm finish I'm going these. to move up to here, spend my one token, take an antelope, and throw him in the water. You are so mean. I'm going to drown Just the antelope. Don't even go there. Okay. I well, you he's just went, thirsty. That's what it is. He's thirsty. He's getting a drink of water. I'm okay. not going to drown an animal. Okay, so we're gonna. I'm going to go. Actually, wait. Will that <clears> work? <throat> Let me think about this for just two seconds. Shoot, 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 shoot. I was hoping I could swap two animals out and and have it fixed, but it doesn't. I can't do that. Um. All right. I think I'm just going to do this. I'm going to go to the move and move him up one space. I'm going to move him right there. I guess this guy lion, so I've got the lion, an elephant, an elephant in grass, and then the meat giraffe for which I get one meat token. Meat token. And at the end of the round, I don't get it right okay. away. Okay. I thought for sure you were going to go and swap a lion, and because you kept looking at that lion, I was like, you touch that lion, <laughs> and he will bite you. I'm going here. <laughs> Pay my coin. Oh shoot, I forgot to pay. I haven't been paying coins. How many turns have I taken? I You went first, so I've taken two turns. I forgot to pay my coins. Sorry. And that's how she wins. I do not. Anyway, I'm taking a though. lion. I am putting it on the grass line. That finishes this guy off. I need a lion on the grass line and another lion and him at the top of the key in the water for seven points. You would think I need plants, but I don't. Hey, points is points. Yes, point two. Okay, I am going to now go and let me think about this. He's already in the trees where I need him. You're now there where I need to be. Giraffe in the water. He needs to be in water. Oh, perfect. Okay, we're going to go here. We're going to swap two animals. I'm swapping this alligator with the water buffalo. So now I have my jackal in the trees, my alligator in the tree line. You already had an alligator in the tree line. I did, oh well that's, and I put in there specifically for this card. Jesus criminy. Is there something else I needed in the tree line? Nope, you already made me, too bad. Ha 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 ha, because you oh, needed crap. that I just, water yeah, buffalo in the tree line there I too. Just, so. I just realized that, just did that. Yeah. No, wah, actually that'll work, that'll work fine. And then, okay, so starting over. Jackal, either alligator now. 
my giraffe in the water and my water buffalo in the water. So I finished this one, which gives me an FX token each at round. the start of each round. Okay, your turn. Okay. I need more cards soon. I am now going to go down here to pay one token to pick up a zebra and put him right there. Okay. I'm going to... <laughs> I'm going to go here to pick up this last elephant to put right here. So I've got one of the trees, mm -hmm. one, one, done. Nine one of points. The trees. One of the trees. I'm sorry, one of the grass. It's grass. I just okay. can't read. And it gives me nine points to go right there. Okay, so I was really hoping to hold off on him because he doesn't have any icons. So I could have scored two extra points for him if I had waited, but I saw the opportunity. But so you I don't have I don't eight have the those. eight. I know. Right. If I had waited until I had eight, but I right. don't. So that's okay, though. Okay. So, but I got my nine points from so him. So my turn. I'm going to go and do this number and pick up a vulture to put right here. And now I have this. I have a zebra. Zebra, hyena, vulture, and antelope. Which gives me some more bananas, but gets me nothing else. Oh, actually, it gives me my first bananas. Okay. But that's seven points. I don't know that I want to do that yet. All right, I'm actually going to go here. I'm going to renew this whole grouping. Then you will get one. I'm lucky, yes, and then I get to pick one of them up. I'm hoping to get something with some hearts on it, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. Of course not. Um, I don't think I have enough of those to make that worthwhile. I think at this point my best option might be these silly paw prints, but I don't think I can get it done in time mm -hmm. to do anything. Water... He's already in the trees. That's nice. Zebra is not in the water, so I'd have to move two of them to water, and I don't know how I can get that accomplished. But I will take him as my extra card. That is my turn. Okay. Oh, put a new card out. Yep. I guess I have to move two. Okay. Okay. Um. Just setting up. No, I know. And you just went to the swap location, you brat. Yes, I did. It's where I needed to be. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah whatever. Such a shame. You know what? <laughs> Pain in the water. Nope. I could get hyena in the water if I had any food tokens, but I don't. So, shoot. I'm not going to get... Well, I have one lion, don't I? Yeah, I have one lion. And a paw print, but I think you have way more than that already. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to pay my last one to go over here. Ooh, all the hyenas are out, aren't they? Oh, yeah, there's the fat one there. Okay. And I guess I'm going to take a zebra and put a zebra right there. Okay. End of the round. Okay. So, so the start of the fourth first. round, we do migration first. So the migration goes this way. Ooh, I put so. him in the right place because if I almost put him there, he'd be gone. Okay. So this space. This space disappears, this space goes, he migrates, he migrates, that one, that one, and then these two spaces here. I think that's everything, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so these space, those animals all migrate off the board, and these go back up to their holding areas. Hyena, and a water buffalo. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. I get one of these. Oh, we yeah. get seven coins. Oh, we can do the awards here in just a minute. Well, I get this and this from my cards. Oops, come on. Come in there. 
We each get seven, seven coins, coins here. We just pick up. Alright, I'm not finding what I need here. I can't okay, see so we still have to score this. This is the lion lover. I have four lions and two paws, so that's a total of six. I have one and one. So, so I, I get, get six times two. So you get 12 points. So that puts you at 29. And I get two points. Alright. Um... Of course, I'm already there. Okay, that's not gonna help me any. Eh? He's down in the trees already. Zebra in the water, hyena, I can put out. All right, let's just start with that. I'm gonna go here, pay my coin, throw this hyena out into the water, give him a bath. So I finished this guy, I've got a zebra in the water. The rhino down there in the trees and a uh, hyena up here in the water so I get two paw prints and two which is a, a turn too late but whatever mm -hmm. and two victory points all right your turn alligator in the sewers. oh you went right where I needed to go oh darn sorry did that sound sarcastic at all that sounded a little <laughs> condescending, I think, right? Is that the word I'm looking for? Probably. Okay, what kind of cards are out there that I could use? <clears throat> you don't need any of those cards. Sure I do. No, you don't. Sure I do. Oh, sure yeah, sure. I Take do. one of them and then reveal a three-heart one. That would be fabulous. I don't know if I want any of those though. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, none of those look terribly appealing. The paw prints are good, mm -hmm. but the rest of them yeah, don't. Yeah, I'm looking at those. Don't look appealing. But to I'm me looking just yet. for bananas. So I guess I'm going to go down here. Okay, renew the whole scene. Renew the whole scene. More paw prints. Hearts. That's a nice one. More hearts, more hearts, and more paw prints. So no bananas. I get one of those. I think, though, I am going to do. Sometime today. Oh, you need to quiet down. <laughs> We're going to put you on a timer. I'm trying to see where I'm at on these. You don't need to look. Just I think go. I'm just going to take this one. Okay. Did you pay your money? You paid yes, your money. Great. I'm going right here. I'll wait it. First of all, let's do this. Nope. I'm taking this one. Okay. Figured you would. I knew you were going to take either one of them. Well, but. yes. Okay, I so still need now that you finally moved, two more. <laughs> I'm going down here, taking well, a vulture. I finally moved. Taking a vulture and I'm placing <coughs> it right there. <coughs> I'm using my VFX token. Because I need two vultures in the trees. One's in the vultures. grass, right. I need an alligator in the water and a giraffe in the tree. That gives me three hearts now. Okay. Fine. No points, but three hearts. Whatever. You're fine. It's all good. Okay, so I am going to... There's only one jack on the board. He's not close to water yet. Shoot. Okay, that's fine. I am... Oh, thank goodness. Right there. I'm going to go right there. Take one. Put a water buffalo in... There are no trees available. No, there's no trees available. Well, in that case, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to pay that to move him down to there and put the water buffalo in the trees. So I get to this one done. So I've got an alligator in the trees, a water buffalo in the trees, and a giraffe, nope, a giraffe in the trees as well. So that finishes that one off and gives me two more hearts, but nothing else. Okay, your turn. I'm going to okay. go and spin that, and I'm going to come down to here to move three. 
One, two, three. Okay. I guess the easiest thing to do is just go back to there and put that out since you're on the move space. And I'll put them in the water and that finishes off this card where I've got a jackal in the water and a water buffalo in the trees. I get two victory points and another heart. So now I'm at okay. seven hearts. One more heart and I can start getting extra points for cards with no effects. Okay. I'm going to go here and take this card. Uh, of course you are. You are mean. You're mean. That's all there is to it. Um, okay. So. Well, you went where I needed to go, so. Well, whatever. You're just mean. I'm going to go down to here, grab a cheetah, and put him right there. Okay. I will go up here now to take him, mm -hmm. place him there, and that's this one. Okay. I have the rock, the alligator, and him on the on gr grass. So. All right. Okay. I'm going to. What do I need? I need him. Here to move. I'm gonna move this guy down two spaces. I'm using my FX token. So I've got grassland. He needs to actually be in the grass. I'm using the FX token to make that grass. And then grass and grass. Mm -hmm. Done. So now these this is one of the diamonds I talked about. So I get I only I don't have any other diamonds, so I only get this one. So it's this diamond plus two, so Times two. Times two. I'm sorry, times two. So that's two. Two plus, plus 11. 11. So I get so a total get of 13, 13 points. points. So if I can find any more, though, now she goes they grow ahead. exponentially. So I get 11 points. So that is 36. And we're going to put that guy. Okay, so this is where you go screaming ahead of me. Yeah, whatever. Right there. Okay. I'm out of cards, though, so. Oh, oh, my dear. Did I pay for that? I don't even know if I paid for those. I don't think we each did. So, okay. All right. Now it's your turn. We'll catch it in the video. I'm sure this round off. Okay, so my turn. <laughs> it's going to have some notes on it. Is. I was going to do what? I am going to go. Go, 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 go. I'm going to go and pay my coin because I'm going to come to swap animals and I'm going to swap. Him you suck. and him. Okay, well, I guess I'm not going to do that then. To get this one lying in the tree. Oh, and then come off. him behind there. Okay. Or did I need to have it this way? No. Okay. Uh, well, is it in line? No, it can go it's in, in line, direction. It's in line. Go in direction. Okay. That's another heart. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got as many hearts as I do, and I'm the one who needs them for my bonus scoring, mm -hmm. not you. Okay. All right, I'm gonna come over here. I'm taking this card. Okay, your turn. Oh, pay for that one. That's gonna be a hard one to do. Good. You deserve it for taking all my hearts. All my what? Life messages. Help what me? You know what I'm talking okay. about. So I'm going to go here, pay my one, and move the crocodile. One, two, three. Okay. And now I have this one. Vulture in the tree and the crocodile adjacent. Okay. Gives me another heart. Okay. I was going to hurt you if you moved what I wanted. So I'm going down here to a swap animal. I'm oh, paying for I came it. From. I know I'm doing that. I was going to swap the crocodile, but you moved him, so. Um, but this still works. So now I've got the jackal in doesn't matter. Well, he doesn't care where he is. Oh, the lion needs to be in the forest. You have no VFX tokens. So you still got to move him over and you don't have any food tokens to move him over. Darn, just going to have to wait till next round and watch the migration take your lion away. My turn. I don't like you anymore. You know that, right? <laughs> 
Oh, it's okay. hilarious. Go. That was not, that was a rather anticlimactic turn. All right, I should have done something different if I'd seen that he was not in the right place. I'm going to go and pay oh, well. that and take this card. Of course you are, because you're going to win the top on the hyenas too because of all your silly claw. Oh, I've got, I've got three. All right, that's the end of the round. So these all go away. So this moves over. There is another migration. All right, ready for migration. this? Oh, 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 you lucked out. So I, this I one, not go anywhere. So this, this one, one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, one, two, this one. So it's here, 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 yep. Oh, man, here, here, and here. Still took one of my pieces. What, what, what? Whatever. Okay. Six so new ones out here. Ooh, look oh. at that. And I'm first player. No. Yes. You are not taking my I'm heart. First player. I hate you. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There you go. You better hope I get some hearts in here. Yeah, well. Not I'm a single one. Oh, but I got that one, so I will take that. I don't even care what I have to do to get it. Can't believe you're gonna you're taking that heart one on my first. Well, heck yes, I'm taking that heart one. I needed to even be able to start Six, scoring. Seven. I needed to win. <laughs> I don't Take care. your seven coins. Oh, my seven coins. And Fine. my first turn. Whoop, that's you. you. Get your extra tokens to. Oh five, no! Six, uh, well, seven. I only get one. I get the. I get one of each. VFX token. I get one of each. Okay, so my first action is to go down there, pay my one, take that heart token from away, away from you. Now, whether I can get it out or not is another choice thing. Don't like him anymore. Because there is no room out there on the board. Okay. It's all good, though. Right? It's all good. So, I'm going to start with... Jackals. Where are the jackals at? They're both right there. I'm already in the swap animal position. So, that does not help me. Okay, we are going to, yeah, I'm just going to go up here and finish this one. Go up here, take this jackal, pay my coin, putting the jackal there, and I'm paying one to move him to there. Okay, so you have your token. So I finally have out. that one now. Okay, okay, so my turn. Yes. I am going to go... Pay my coin to move up to here, taking this Jaguar and sticking him there. Do that from there, do that there. Okay. I'm going to first go to the swap animals. And I'm going to swap. How, am I, how was I just thinking about this? These two. Okay. so I can't go there. So, okay. Oh, pay my coin. You're already down to four coins. Did I miss another turn? I Probably. swapped. Yeah, I put one out, I moved, I swapped. Yeah, okay, good. Okay. Sorry. Pay to go to the swap. And I was swapping one. Moving this guy up three, and that gets this one. Elephant on a rock, uh, jackal on a rock, and hyena in the water. 
That gives me three points. One, two, three. Okay, you're lucky that actually helped you. Almost worked in my favor. Yes, because I was it, it. It didn't help, but it didn't hurt me either. So I'm going to here. No, I can't even move though. Okay. Um. I still only have three freaking bananas. I have not seen any, hardly any bananas come up. I got two. Mm -hmm. You keep taking my hearts, so I'm going to start taking your bananas. How many do you need? You need four? <laughs> You're I, not four. Score. I have one. I have three bananas. I have not been able to score this at all, either because of you. Because you keep taking I'm closer my, my for mine than you are. I might actually if, have a chance to win this game. If I even score any more of these, and I don't even have any. That's the only time I even score them is if I do this. So this is a this is a hard one. I thought I'd try it, but when somebody's no, stealing all the like icons, it doesn't help. Just saying. Okay. We got so, her on the ropes. She's starting to get upset starting about it. Starting to get upset about it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? I'm gonna do this instead. Since you're in the spot I need, I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna take this diamond one. Notice it's two diamonds. Yeah, okay. I just, I'm not gonna be able to pull it off though, but whatever. All right, your turn. Oh, take my token. Your turn. Okay, I'm gonna come down here to the swap to pay my token. You swap two ID numbers. And I'm gonna swap this one with this one, and that finishes off this one. Of course it does. Jaguar in the grasslands, uh, antelope, jaguar in the water, and a zebra, in a straight line. Okay, whatever. That now gives me. Ten hearts. Whatever. Yeah, I know. I, I don't like you because you keep stealing all my cards. All right, fine. I'm going Ten hearts that equates <laughs> to 50 points. What? Oh, I hate you. Yeah, you definitely, because I've only got 20 That's why I this. said there could be a chance I could actually do it this time. I do not like you. Okay. I'm finishing this one off. I'm going to the move animals. I'm moving him. One, two... So I'm finishing this guy. I've got the rhino in the grass, the jackal in the grass, a jackal in the grass, and a jackal in stone. So this is one of the diamonds. I now have two diamonds. So it's two times two, so four plus 11, so 15 points. I need to definitely get as far ahead of him as I can this round. Okay, your turn. Oh, that was my I'll pay for that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's no zebras left. Nope, they're all on the board. And I cannot move. Good. Because you're on the move. I only have one point left. Oh, bummer. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel sorry for you in the least. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go here, see if I can get a banana off. come up. Or three more hearts that you're going to take from me. I don't need any more hearts, but... Oh, oh. <laughs> you're going to get the exact same cards full of that. It looks just like the same ones I had before. So we have nothing. We have a banana. Oh, darn it. We have two bananas. Oh. And no hearts. And That's no right. hearts, because I, I have no heart, according to her. Um, let's see, yep. where are we at here? The elephant's on the rock, the gator's not on the rock, and neither's the vulture, but it's the best to get right there. I'm taking that one and you get a no heart. Sorry, I wasn't I couldn't do them anyway. Well I could have, I guess, because I could have just gone down there. Why where are you at? You didn't even move. Oh I moved move to here. That one. Yes, there you go. Okay. Zebra there and we're gonna have another migration so I know animals are gonna disappear off the board, which is going to upset me if they disappear after I do this move. But it is what to do. Is my hyenas are all damn. All right, well, we're just gonna go here to swap. I even have. Yeah, well, I was hoping to get this guy out first because you know it's three hyenas, mm, but I don't. It's just a shame. I just <laughs> you're getting, making me mad. Whatever. Okay. So, so uh, that's my turn. That's the end of the game. Round. That's the end of the, round. End of the game. Migration. Migration. 
Let me just suck her out. Oh, so <laughs> you these got are to your, be kidding so me. So this one's that gone. That zebra's gone. My zebra disappears that I wanted. And these two are gone. Okay. Ah, oh, my elephant in the stone. Yep, my zebra disappeared. The whole one I was basing my, my whole thing around just migrated off the board. Mm -hmm. All right, this goes right there. The elephant goes right there. And I get a VFX token again. I get two oh, I've, got, I've got three of them now. Two of them. I mean. token. Okay, so let's see what, let's see how we cannot give her any hearts. We have two bananas. Oh, there's a heart. Point doesn't give me a lot of good. Ooh. Ooh, another diamond. Ooh. Ooh, and she's first player this turn. I oh, am. there's all your hearts. There's all my hearts, yep. There's your four card. Please give me more hearts. I can't let her have or, ten ooh, hearts. Diamond too. Because it's my only chance of winning. <laughs> oh my gosh, what do I want to do? Well, those hearts do me absolutely nothing, though. I think I'm going to take that one, get I'm rid of those. Look at this. I'm points. throwing away hearts because I got a diamond. And I'm first player, so, oh, guess where I'm going to go? Oh, wait, we need our coins first. Let's get our... Oh, and we need to score those. We're I'm, like, yes. totally jumping the gun here. She's all excited because she I got... Am. She can get hearts. I can finally get my hearts. Five... Six, All right, and now we have to score seven. hyenas. I have Nine. one. Seriously? Two, I have three, lots of jackals. Four, five. I, I have five. six, so I have a total oh, of eight. Oh, wait. You have a total of eight? Okay, this might be close. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Okay, eight. so we each have eight, so we each get 16 points because we both okay. get the awards. So that's so 16 and 32 is 48 and 15 that'd be 67. Okay, now push those all back up. Man, if I'd been able to get those other ones out, I should have focused on those instead of the other one, I did, instead of this one. Dang it, and you're going to get that other three heart. Heck, yes, I am. And okay, my so 50 now points I'm won't here. matter. Nope. Taking that one. Because you can only get up to 10 points or 10 hearts. No, you continue on. I read that um, you score. So if you have 10, you score the 10. And then if oh, you have three more, out. you score three more. I'm going back more. and getting my two heart card. That's That was your heart card. That was yes. my two heart card. Because I didn't think I could score any more hearts. Yes, you can continue scoring hearts. Okay, so how do I deal with this and still try and win this game? It's not going to be easy. No. Well, I've got to do a lot of I'll have to, to go here, spend one, and take a rhino and put him right there. Nothing lined up here. All right. I'm going to first go here to move that up to there. Okay. I'm going to go down here and take this card. Um, oh, right here, take a zebra, put it there with an FX token, and that finishes off this guy, because I can use the FX token to cover that one, so I've got a zebra in the grass, hyena in the grass, hyena in the grass, and hyena with special effects, so that gives me three diamonds, so that's six plus 11, so... 17, uh, so that'd be 84, right, right, and then that goes away, okay. Okay, so I'm going here to come, where did I do? oh yeah, it's coming back down here. Completed this Grab one. this guy and put that there, and I now have this one, the three rhinos in the row, one of them in the water. I get a meat. Okay. So that's what, 8, 10, 12? Okay. 
All right, so I'm trying to decide which one's more important to finish. If I finish this one, it takes me from seven to 10, which on the scoring card is the difference of 25 points. If I finish this one, it gives me a fourth diamond, which would be eight, so it'd be 19 points. So technically this is worth more points. Now the question is, which one can I finish? If either because they're both straight line ones and gonna be really hard to maneuver set things up. around. Yeah, to maneuver things around. Um, I mean, this one might not be too bad. I could probably pull him off easy enough. Him, I'm not so sure. So I think I may have to go for this one just so I can get it done. That's gonna be worth 20 points right there. This one 19, yeah. This one's worth 19 points. This one's effectively worth 25. 9 plus 11 is 20. No. I have 4. Oh, 4. Oh, eight. okay. 8 times plus yeah. 11. Okay, I'm sorry. So I cannot yeah, math 19. today. <laughs> okay. So this requires having... Is he... Okay. So I may have to use my effects token for that one. Okay. So let's go... Ah, I'm already there. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's whatever. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so we're going to go here then, pay my coin, and put this guy out right here. All right, your turn. Did you seriously just do that? Uh, yes. Okay, I will wait before I go and be really cruel to you. Because I was about to move this guy to there. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. Sorry. I will hold off for two rounds. Two rounds. <laughs> if you don't have any two rounds, I'm sorry about your luck. Okay. Okay, right, so I'm going to go up to here and put this vulture right there. Okay. And then I'm going to use both my... Well, wait a second. Let me see if I have to yet. No. I'm going to use my meat token to move this elephant up to the rock. Okay. And then I need a gator. Okay, so I'll use one FX token for here. I need a vulture on the rock. I need an elephant on the rock. And I need a gator on the rock. But the, this grassland is going to turn rocky with that. Okay. So that gives me my two bananas. And I get to draw a card from here. All right. Let's see what we can get out of here. Oh, I see which one I would take. That. Yep. It's already done, basically, right? You just need to move one. You got to swap an animal out. That's all you got to do. Yeah. I don't know why I'm helping you, because that's going to give you more points. Mm-hmm. But whatever. Okay, so this guy, I am going to move here, pay my coin. Move him to here. Use my FX token to pretend that's a rock. So I've got him on with an FX token for rock, grassland, grassland, grassland. And that one's done for 19 points. So that is what? 103? Yeah, and I'm at 47 now. 48. You're at 48. I think I'm going to lose. Okay. Because 50 on top of 48 does not get me to 100. Well, you're probably going to get 60 depending on how you play these next three rounds. Your turn. Okay, so. I, oh, i got to put a card down. I'm going to go. I'm not sure how you have to go there. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, he's gonna go right. Nope, he's gonna go right there. Okay. Because he's gonna be on the grasslands. Oh, okay. So, yep, that works. No points. Yeah, uh, yeah. But you get points at the end. So that puts you at what? Thirteen now. So that means you get another ten points. No. No, I get seven points. Seven points. Okay. All right. Anyway. Okay. I don't know that I can. I don't think there's any way to pull this guy off. Um, in two turns plus two. Well, you got two free movements right I know, there. I know, but I don't think they're... They have to be in a straight line. 
and I just don't think. And one's got to be in water, one's got to be in a tree. Yeah, so I've got a jackal here. Oh, he can come off the board. So I don't know that there's a way to pull that one off. So I think what I'm going to do is, God, that's 25 points though. Yes, that is. If you can get it, it's 25 points, which I'm voting for you not to get. Because <laughs> then I have a shot at beating you. Okay, so instead, I think I'm going to have, even though I fought like crazy to get that three hearts, I just, I think it was too little too late. I can't do anything with mm -hmm. it. So, I think instead, I see one that I can possibly make work. You can't get that to work. No, not that. No, I, I know I can't get that one to work, especially with only two turns left. Mm-hmm. Um... No, not being I was, all on the... I was looking at this one, so I can at least try to make use of my celebrity once. But I just, uh, Jaguar, Vulture, Hyena. And no requirements as far as that. I can make it work. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go here to pick up this card. Pay your money. Pay my money. I don't want to go over there. And then put a new card out. So my turn. Yep. Why did you throw that money? In there? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm going to go down here to swap animals. I'll swap these two animals out. Pull this one off. Uh, of course. Elephant in the grass and with the jaguar by it. Okay. All right. And now I've got these. Oh, you're on the swap. Okay, that's fine. I can just do a move two animals. There you go. And now I've got the Jaguar, Vulture, Jaguar, Vulture, Hyena. Finish this one, so it's seven points. Plus, since I have eight, look at that. I actually get to score my celebrity. I get, I have eight mm -hmm. hearts, so anytime I score something with no icons up here, I get an extra two, which means this is worth nine. Don't get so excited. I Don't just, I was like excited to get to use it to show them how it worked. And that was my last turn. Even though I have two, but there's no way I can do anything to make that work. So, much as I would like to. You doubled my score already. You more than doubled my score. <laughs> Sorry. But you can still score this, and you I have know, and I still a get lot one of more turn. there. And you have one more turn. Which I can't do what I wanted to do because I can't get to that area. Because that needs to be in a straight line, and there's nothing in that yeah, we migrated. Okay. Yeah, I can't because I'm on the swap already. Oh, yes, oh, I no. can. <laughs> oh, no, I can't because you're right there. Oh, yes, I can. I can go down there, pay my coin, take this buffalo, set it there, use this, and I scored this one. Okay, wait, let me see. What'd you do? Jaguar. I, I, I went down there, put this here. Jaguar on he, the rocks. He's on the grass. Jaguar on the rocks. Watch, I have that, so I'm making the 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 plane the rock one. area to get that. So okay. It gives me a prawl print and two points. And two points. All right. So I have. That. Okay. So that is the end of gameplay now. So now we just do final scoring. Final scoring is pretty easy. You score any of your assistants that have end game scoring. Mine did not. Mine was all in game. But Greg's got, has end game. I got twelve points because I have. Four bananas plus, I have five bananas. I have one flower and one VFX token okay. or icon, so I get, okay. 12, so you get points. 12 points. So I'm at 62. 62, all right. And then we score our hearts our or hearts, our, yeah. our likes. Our, our likes, yeah. I have a total of seven, so I get, based on this, this score, I get a total of 25. So I go from 12 to 37, so I've got 137 and points. Still Kill me because I only get sixty. So you go that to that puts one hundred and twenty-two. Yeah, hundred. Yeah. And that's again, not that bad. And once again, I lose. <laughs> I am zero and three at this game. So that is how you play Wild Serengeti. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I have to admit, this was a really fast turnaround on a Kickstarter, especially for it to be as beautiful as it is. These pieces, I mean, I couldn't ask for better. I really could. They are absolutely gorgeous. So, 
I hope you enjoyed this. Um, please let us know in the can... comments if she cheated anywhere then and, and I should have won, you know. Nice try. <laughs> I don't know. You forgot to pay a few times. And I caught up on that. Please like the video if you enjoyed enjoyed what we did. Feel free to subscribe to the channel. Help us out there. Hit the bell icon if you want notification of future content. You can always follow us on all of our social medias as well. Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter mm -hmm. by searching The Meeple Society. And if you want to hear us talk about it, you can listen to our podcast, The Meeple yes. Society. Yes. You can get that anywhere you can get your podcasts. All right. Well, with all that being said, we will catch you on the next playthrough.